Roof Framing The roof of the main house will be framed using the truss set feature. First, open the Roof Options menu to review the current roof settings. Default framing properties for the roof, such as framing spacing, truss style, and truss cord depth, can be set for the project in this menu. Select OK. To begin framing the roof, select Draw, Framing, Gable and Truss. Using the two-click drawing process, draw the gable and trusses. Select the 3D Framing Shaded tab to review the gable and trusses in 3D. Open a new vertical tab group to view the 3D framing mode side by side with the 2D roof plan. Next, a truss set can be added. Select Draw, Framing, Truss Set. Using the expanding box method of drawing, indicate where the truss set is to be set. Regardless of whether this roof is being stick-framed or trussed, the framing members will be laid out to conform to the roof shell. Additionally, if the ceiling board were vaulted, the truss members would also form their bottom cord to match, thereby creating a scissor truss. Right-click the truss set and select Edit. Change the spacing to 24 inches and select OK. Rafters can also be added quickly using the Auto Stick Frame feature. Select Draw, Framing, Auto Stick Frame. Click on the garage roof to automatically frame it with rafters. Using these methods, the remaining roof framing can be easily completed. Orient the camera around the 3D framing model to review the appearance of the roof framing. 